Hello guys and welcome back to our channel of Handy Games. My name is as always Jan and I'm very happy and very proud to introduce you to our new Devils and Demons Arena Wars update. So what's new in the Arena Wars update? <sighs> Basically a lot of stuff. I will not be able to cover all the changes but one of the or, or some of the major changes include that we increase the level cap from 30 to 50. Your health and damage increase um, now each player rank for all heroes. And there are many new enemies and bosses. Of course, we did not only add a lot of new enemies and bosses, we also um, added six new unlockable characters, which you can find in the new arena mode. We also increased all loot that drops from enemies, and there are a dozen of new skills. We didn't only introduce new characters and new skills for them, but these skills now also have many bonus effects that can occur on critical hits, like for example bleeding or burning debuffs, and we are also introducing procs in many abilities. But of course, the biggest change in this update is definitely the arena. Now yes, the arena. There is a lot to gain in the arena, but also a lot to lose. You can enter your first arena when reaching level 15. It costs 2000 gold to enter the arena, but have no fear if you are able to survive, like in this dungeon, um, the first 10 waves, then you can earn new characters, new skills and a lot of gold. There are some new rules in the arena. You start with 5 potions, um, there is no rebuying of potions and you cannot revive with gold. So you need heroes that can um, cast a revive spell to revive some of your heroes. But yes, that's basically it. You can use the arena to quickly rank up your heroes and grind some experience or gold. And it's a lot of fun, but it's also quite challenging. So if you lose the arena, then you lose your attendance fee. Now, after you've battled your way through the arena, with all the different new bosses and their new abilities and hordes of enemies, you are greeted with this new reward screen. You gain a lot of gold and experience, as you can see. And yeah, in the reward screen, you can choose between three cards. And yeah, there are different rewards. You can gain some gold. But if you're not satisfied with your reward or chosen reward, then you can re-roll. And maybe something better comes out of it, like this new unlocked ability for the priest, for example. And this is the way how you unlock new skills and characters for your party. It's entirely done in the arena, of course, in addition to the normal story mode. And yes, that's it for our short info video for the upcoming arena update for devils and demons if you want to see some more and more details on the arena there is another video coming up where i will play through the um, high level arena for level 30 with a bigger party and yeah there we will um, talk uh, more in depth about the arena so i guess we are done here 
as always, if you like our videos, like and subscribe. And yes, I will see you guys next time.